Hello, I'm Timothy, and in this video, we are going to look at ArcGIS Pro sorting. So let's get in and get started. So first of all, we want to go ahead and open up our attribute table. I'm going to right click and go straight into attribute table here. Here I have a, a zoning feature class uh, with a variety of fields within the table. Basic sorting and custom sorting are our options. Basic sorting applies essentially a sort to a single field. For example, if I want to uh, fill, uh, sort based upon the shape area, all I have to do is double click on the field name. This will sort it within ascending order. And then each time you double click, it will switch to um, the opposite. So if I double click here, it'll go to descending order. Now, another way to go about sorting uh, using the basic sort is to right click and sort ascending or descending. So you can get this right directly from the menu here. Or right click and descend. Now that is basic sorting. Now, there is what's called custom sorting. Custom sorting is the ability to apply uh, sort to more than one field. To access custom sorting, you can right click on a field. So I'm going to right click on my pre zip code field here and click custom sort. As you see here, it already has. Uh, that shape length sort applied, we can hit clear to remove that sort. And then we can begin creating a custom sort. For example, I want to sort this by zip, uh, by my zoning code here. So I'm going to select Z code ascending and then after my zone code I'm going to sort by shape area then click OK and you'll see here that my zoning code is sorted alphabetically here and the shape area sorts as well so you can see it increases from there now you can of course apply it to more than uh, two fields. And to remove that sort, right click, go to custom sort and clear. Now that is how you do it through uh, this little dialog window here. However, you can also use the shift key and double click on the fields you'd like to apply. So maybe this time I would like to sort on shape length. So holding on the shift key, I'm going to uh, double click on shape length. And then uh, let's then go by uh, the pre-zone code. Now if I right click on this and open up the custom sort, you'll see that the custom sort has been applied. This again is, is applied using the shift key and double clicking on the fields that I'd like to participate in the sort. I'm going to clear this out and close this here. I hope this information was helpful. If you'd like to learn more about the attribute table, check out this playlist. Once again, thanks for watching.